Hey, wanna know five ways to reduce your carbon footprint? Number one, buy secondhand clothes. <sighs> Who said you had to destroy the planet to be fashionable? Number two, alternative modes of transport. On average, a typical passenger vehicle will emit 4.6 metric tons of CO2 every year. P.U., that's a lot. Many trips could easily be replaced by walking, cycling, or public transport. So you won't be needing these anymore. <laughs> Number three, live with a roommate. My roommate burns an average 3.2 tons of carbon heating his home every year. But ever since I moved in with him, I've doubled the effectiveness of those emissions, and he doesn't even know it. Where are my keys? Number four, limit food waste. Every day, my roommate throws away one whole pound of food just because he thought it went bad. But by making a grocery list, he could reduce the amount of food that he throws out. Number five, stop creating people. In a developed country, a child will cost an average of 58.6 metric tons of carbon each year. That's why I've gotten my roommate chronically addicted to video games, to make sure that his chances of repopulating are kept to a minimum. Well, there you have it. Hopefully these five tips help make your carbon footprint virtually disappear, just like the evidence they had against me in my previous breaking and entering case. <laughs> Anyways, bye!